Hey, how's it going? Well, I'm going to be heading shortly. I just want to make a quick video before I did. I'm glad that companies like Verizon have these upgrade options for, for their phones. Um, my, you know, this one, well, <laughs> I'm glad that they give those options, but I sometimes wonder whether or not they make sure that older phones have crappier service. You know that video I made about Thunderfoot? Right? I made that with this phone. That one minute video took 45 minutes to upload. And we're on the unlimited plan. 45 minutes to upload a one minute video. I was in an area that has the signal is just fine. Of course, if I connected it to wireless, it would it would do all right too. But on the 4G, 45 minutes to upload a one minute video. So I called them to find out, uh, you know, hey, what's going on? And uh, oh, let's let's reset all of your settings on your phone. Uh, no. Um, let's talk to someone else because you're just like reading these things off a screen. So talk to someone else and eventually I got led to someone who was who really did have a, a lot of answers and it just ends up that, I don't know, uh, maybe there is something because I had rooted this phone uh, there might have been some. There, there was an update that they wanted, that Samsung wanted people to do on these phones, and well, I wasn't letting it because I had the phone rooted and had 20 apps disabled. Because Verizon will pack on all these apps that you can't. Uh, I should say I had all these apps uninstalled. Um, you can disable most of the apps. But there's still something about them that runs when just having them on the phone slows it down. And when I removed those 20 apps from this phone, it made it usable. Originally, I wasn't going to use this. I was going to continue using the uh, iPhone 6 that has crappy mics that no one can understand what I'm saying when I make videos with it. So <clears throat> anyway, so. Verizon, you know, had let me do an upgrade. So I now have a uh, Moto Z uh, Force. Moto Z Force. This is one of the ones that has the, you know, they have a plastic screen. I think all phones should have a plastic screen. And if you want something, if you want to put a cover on it so you'll scratch that instead of scratch the screen, fine. But stop making phones out of glass. The, 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 I, I mean, it's stupid. Oh, but it's Gorilla Glass. It's blah, 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 glass. It's blah, 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 glass. I don't care what the brand name of the fucking glass is. It's glass. It's stupid to make something that you could drop so easily out of glass. That's stupid. And so I'm glad there's phones that are coming out like this. Anyway, uh, this phone has been awesome. I've, I've, en I've, I've never enjoyed a phone more than this one. However, however, <laughs> Google or whoever it really is that handles updates to Android um, decided to let's let's start at imitating Apple and remove functionality from the phones. And so they made it so notification volume is the same as ringtone volume. Oh, that's so nice. That's that's great. Great. Now I have to create, you know, four versions of each sound file I use for no, for not you know for notifications for an app, and then every time I want to make some changes, then I have to go through, and you know, like okay, 20, uh, this sound twenty five percent volume, this sound fifty percent volume, this sound seventy five percent volume, and this sound a hundred percent volume. You know, four different versions of the file, right? Of, of the audio file that way you know I can make change the volume of that depending on what I'm doing by changing the actual notification sound because that's the only option they give anymore and and that's because I don't generally I don't I don't think I've ever had notifications volumes all the way up 
Otherwise, everywhere I go, bring, 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 Facebook, bring, 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 Skype, bring, 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 going somewhere else, bring, 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 no thanks, no thanks, no, no interest. Well, you you know you can turn them off. It's, I don't want to turn them off. I want to know that they're happening. I want to to know if something's quiet. I want to be able to look at the phone and say, hey, you know, this is I've I've gotten a, I've gotten some sort of notification. Great, let's let's take a look when it when it's when it's convenient. I know that I've gotten some. You know, I could tell. I could hear a little bit of it once in a while. Okay, fine. You know, the phone calls are what's important. Someone's calling you, it's probably pretty important. Okay, that I want loud. I always want that loud. The, the notifications I want quiet. I certainly don't want them muted. Oh, well, you can set it for for the buzz thing. So, yeah, so I'm going to stand around trying to have a conversation. Bzzz, 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 bzzz. I mean, those aren't quiet. The whether the, you know, the, the vibrate isn't actually that quiet. If there was a way of them doing it where it, people weren't continually hearing it, I mean, you're trying to have a conversation, and then I have a little, I, I went over here and did, and did a little, okay, and this is a minute, all right, um, <laughs> you know, so, I, I, I don't understand that move to me that's pretty fucking boneheaded, um, I, I I don't get it. It's it's stupid. And now so now I have to spend a bunch of time, uh, you know, when I when I want to go out or I want to do different things, I have to spend a bunch of time. Uh, well, let's go through and change the notification for this app, and 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 then change the, the general notification sound to this too. Every time I want to make any sort of change, let's just go to each individual app and do all this stuff because Google decided that, that notification sounds should be the same as, as the ringtone volume. That's fucking stupid, Google. That's stupid shit. Really stupid shit.